All right, so I took a quick break, and now we are back for another episode of Assassin's Creed Mirage. So welcome back, guys. If you're new to the channel, welcome. So in the last episode, we took out another order member, the treasurer, who turned out to be a Asian uh, woman who is like heavy on taxes and imports and exports of trade, especially foreign goods, because um, basically from what I've uh, what I saw and heard, uh, like hear her say. Uh, moments before uh, we killed her the purpose of this was because since she grew up poor she wants like power wealth and everything uh things like one-of-a-kind items and very expensive uh, expensive like arts and pieces so basically in my opinion this uh may have like helped the order by like using the money taken from tax and everything to fund everything but you can see like there was a personal uh like a personal goal here like uh, to have like everything uh to have everything that she did not have when she was younger so it was more like a uh, more like a selfish goal if you ask me but anyway so now we have taken out every single order member now we go for the top so this may be the last episode who knows uh depending on how long uh we can go so without anything else let's get into it so we got re Port to the bureau. You took your time. Did you wait up, master? I wait for no man. You look tired. Nothing a little adventure won't fix. What news? Ali thinks the time is right to attack the palace. The Oyun are distracted and the people divided. Divided how? Some are claiming the new Khalifa stole the throne from Abu Abdullah, son of al mutabakil What do you know of him? Little. He was there at the palace, the night his father... The night I reached into that chest. Master, have we learned anything more about the object within? Why do you ask? It seems a shame we know so little about something the Order prized so much. Should we not seek to know our enemies better, the better to defeat them? Marhaban Basim, have I interrupted? No. We must turn to the task at hand. Of course, Abu Abdullah. Rebecca tells me you have met his mother, Qabiha. I did. I think she could be first among our foes. She, or Arib the poet, or Muhammad, the governor. All three had ties to our enemies. Muhammad ibn Tahir. His cousins govern the land on which Alamut sits. Their protection is all that shields us from our enemies. I cut our enemies' legs beneath their master. Let me strike while their stumps are bloody. I will unmask them and learn their intent. Basim is right. We must act swiftly. Go to the Round City. Investigate all three, but take no further action. Reports back to me atop the house of the previous hill. Poet, politician, and concubine. I will soon know which one wears the mask. Oh, before I go, uh, I want to show you guys one thing. I, I changed the outfit because last time, uh, last episode, we wore the Isu assassin outfit, but this time we are wearing the hidden one outfit. However, I put on the costume of the master assassin costume. So this is what it looks like without the, the master assassin costume. It looks like this. It kind of looks like, if you ask me, Looks like uh, from Assassin's Creed Origins, but I just threw this on too. Makes it a little bit more clean and kind of reminds me of Ezio. Alright. Find Mohammed. Okay, so there are three objectives. I'll do the closest one right now. And I'm gonna fast travel because getting through the Damascus Gate is a pain. Because that thing is like 
levels uh, leveled with like so much security and guards and you got to keep on paying merchants that like token to like get through but since I already have like fast travels within uh, the walls I might as well use them Damn marksmen. They are vigilant. The Madalim courts are close. Derwish once told me it is where the commons can appeal when justice itself is dealt unjustly. Oh, I thought we could climb it. Never mind. My father once said, To know the measure of a man, ask those who work beneath him. These judges must know the governor better than most. Right, so that's this one. Greetings, Sayyidi. I wonder if I could ask you some questions about the governor, Muhammad ibn Tahir. I am not underpaid to answer questions. I suggest you make this worth my time. Otherwise... Uh, it's a good thing I've been pickpocketing a lot. <laughs> Would you accept this token of appreciation from a humble citizen? Hmm. I would. As a start. Are you kidding me? I serve justice, not spoil it. Take your money. Now, what do you know about the governor? He's feared, respected, dedicated to the rule of law, order. That is all you know. You work here. Muhammad ibn Tahir keeps office at the courts. At the shorter courts, not the Mathalim. He does keep spies here. One scuttles back to his office every day at noon. Goodbye now. I can't- I paid two tokens for that? Oh man! Alright, yeah, I got past time. By the way, do you guys like my talisman, the gold talisman I have? That's the assassin one. There he is. That messenger could lead me to the governor's office. And whatever secrets he buries there. He's about to turn around. Ooh. Thought you could lose me. Oh. Oh, I thought he was about to turn around. Lose them again. What are you talking about? He was in sight. Oh, 
هذا ما كنت بحاجة إليه بالضبط. من كان يخطر على باله أن الملوزية الموقرة. This guy keeps on stopping randomly, so this one's a little bit tricky. I had a feeling he was going to turn when I saw the soldiers. The Weesh always warned me I would be dragged to the Shorta. Who would have imagined I would walk in willingly? Not welcome here. Damn. I thought maybe. Alright, frontal approach. Can you guys take care of it? Some steel? Care for some exercise. You You're to this! They lost two of their guys. I'm not sure. I did not see him go upstairs. something would happen and it did <laughs> Trap didn't go off. Yeah. 
Yes, yeah, the key. Poverty was my only cry. Free me of this pain, please. Save me. I cannot bear this any longer. Thanks. They can help me out. Let's go, uh, let's get upstairs. At last. There we go. The Tahirids agreed to withdraw their protection from Alamut at the governor's request. The hidden ones are betrayed. The governor has been tracking the rebels and the hidden ones. Uh oh. So we've been betrayed? Ocean, desert, cobra, dove. It seems he is an admirer of Arib the poet. Residential Abu Abu is for allegiance to our Kali version of Abu. You can tell your masters I've had copies made. Shred that page, slit my throat. Our bargain stands. My masters? The masked cabal, the order of... I don't care. Are you not in their service? Are you not in their service? I serve the Khalifa. I serve Allah. And I do it without hiding my face. Now, if you'll excuse me. Why were you giving commands to Asif at Turkey? A member of the order? The brute was stoking the fire of a thousand rebellions. Thankfully, someone spared me the trouble of putting him down. A hidden one, I heard. Hmm. Are you the one to thank? I read your letters. You forced your cousins to remove their protection from Alamut. You sold us to our enemies. And bought peace to Baghdad. You've already helped yourself to the receipt. Abu Abdullah's oath of allegiance. What does he have to do with anything? His ambition would have torn the Khalifa apart. I offered the Order Alamut. They gave me assurance he'd threaten us no more. So to trap a fox, you loose a wolf. The Order will see Baghdad burn, Governor. History will judge you for this. History can hang me for it. I'll leave this world knowing that there is courage in compromise. There is also cowardice. How old are you? Twenty? I was about your age when I came to this city. Righteous beyond reproach. What happened? I grew up. If you really wish to spare Alamut, turn that blade on your enemies. Give me their name. 
the one you brokered the deal with? I could. But if you fail, then I die. And I'd prefer not to. Now, I have things to do. No hard feelings. Guards! Mm. Oh, you! So the day ends with you in the short after all. What was that? Stay alert! Oh, damn it. Oh, there. Help, please. Nope. Okay, fine. Oh, this guy's fast. Order or no, Governor Muhammad is no friend to the Hidden Ones. next Oh whoops Fast travel say the harem is home to hundreds, secluded and kept from sight of men. This place may be more secret than Alamut. The guards will be ever vigilant. What do you see, Enkidu? Poor likeness. 
poster boy. <laughs> they say no man may enter the harem unless he is a eunuch or the Khalifa himself. I am neither, so this could be interesting. Do not even think about it. Keep walking. That was friendly. I will have to find another way in. Her influence wanes. Her followers dwindle by the day. Kabiha is a great woman, Farah. <laughs> she was. While Al Mutawakil lived, but her son did not succeed him, and her time has come and gone. When the tide ebbs, will you be swept with it to the sea? I do not like to get involved in politics, Nasreen. Please. We know what you are. Enough! The new eunuchs will be arriving any minute. Meet them at the gate, Makira, and try not to make a mess of it. Come, Nasreen. New servants mean new faces in the harem. If I had a eunuch's uniform, I could slip in among them. Show me the path ahead. So now we're trying to find a eunuch. A eunuch's uniform freshly tailored. Perfect. How long is this going to take? I'm running late. I... Looks ready to me. Time to make use of this uniform. A bit tight across the chest. And gut. Hopefully this will work. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but the Unix carry weapons and a talisman with the assassin's symbol on it. <laughs> Tomahel, do I know you? I doubt you would. This is my first day. I would hate to be late. Makira, assalamu alaikum. You know him, Makira? Um, uh, I... What? You have forgotten me already. No, no, I... I'm sorry. It has been a long... That is all right, fair one. My face is quite forgettable. Unlike your own. Oh, hey. Farah is expecting me. Between us, she terrifies me. Please do not make me late for her. Let him in, Abbas. Barakallahu fiki, Sayyidati. He's got Riz. <laughs> What are you doing? Makira! I was just... Breaking into Kabiha's office? You are no eunuch. Leave now or I'll tell Nasreen. I'll tell Farah. Tell them what? That you let me in here? I cannot imagine they will be pleased about that. You are a Kahramana, no? You serve the concubines every need. When is the last time someone asked what you needed? Someone who would not judge. Someone you could forget was ever here. There must be something you need, Makira. Or want. There is something. Abbas at the gate. He... He has eyes for Farah. The Umuvalad. He doesn't look at me. But Farah uses a paint to make her eyes bigger. 
And if I could have some, I think he might... Say no more. I am at your service. Where can I find this paint? The storage room, but no one is allowed in. Apart from Nasreen. Farah trusts her with everything, even her magic potion. Farah has a magic potion? She has Nasreen carry it. Tells her when she wants a sip. It makes her breath foul. Still, I'd give anything to try it myself. And so you shall. And in exchange, Makira, what will you give me? The key to that office. I paint and magic potion. Your wish is my command. Oh, I thought I did it wrong. <laughs> I paint and magic potion. Seriously? Hey. I guess people don't have that many desires. Bigger eyes might add to my disguise. No, focus, Basim. You need that key. So what is this magic potion? Ah, I see. Alcohol. <laughs> Here you are. Oh, thank you. The others say I'm too young for paints and potions. But I'm not too young to know why they use such things. Of course not. Now the key. They only know more than me because they've all read this book. The garden and its mysteries. It's all about biology, the body, its secrets. It is quite infamous. Have you read it? No. Farah keeps it in the Khalifa's quarters. They're on the roof, and strictly forbidden. Makira, we had an agreement. Please, if you could just get the book and bring it to my room? It's in the east corner on the left. Oh, fine. But then the key. Paint, potion. Now she has me fetching body books. I meant to play a servant, not be one. Now she's uh, uh, she's taking advantage of this. Okay, there we go. Now I can use. I thought I just can't use any weapons or tools at all. Come on, split. There we go. Man, these big guys are always an issue. Am I in the clear? But the door's barred. Mm. 
quarters fit for a Khalifa. The garden and its mysteries. Not much spice to the title. I guess that was the idea. All right, let's get these back. I swear to God, she has one more request. Abu Abdullah's ambition knows no bounds. Too far off, he cannot still believe he will take the throne. Have you met his mother? Oh, wrong room. <laughs> there you are. Enjoy. Let us hope she does not come up with any more tasks. I think I have created a monster. The book is in your room. Wait, did she? Now. So? Are my eyes bigger? Huge. Makira, I need the key. This portion, it, it gives you confidence. I feel like I could take on the world. Yes, I am familiar with this potion. We she doesn't have a bargain, it, does she? Makira. The key. Now. Wait. You have to return the potion to Nasreen. If Farah finds out it's gone, she'll be furious. Then the key is yours, I swear. Fine. Drink some water while I am gone, will you please? This is the last time, Basim. Put your foot down. Back where you belong. The potion is put back. All is right in the world. Now I will get that key from Makira if I have to pry it from her hands. It is done. I am done. Thank you. Funny, I have a bit of a headache. What happens now? You give me the key. Oh, right. Um... You do oh not have my... You are afraid of Kabiha. What? No, no. Her star is fallen. They all say it. It's just... I was having fun. Here it is. Finally. Now to find my answers. I'm about to kill her, man. I swear to God, I'm about to drag the blade across her throat. A hairpin. Nings. When did Kabiha get it? Ocean, desert, cobra, dove. It's the same one. book of Harib's poems. The ocean, the desert, the cobra, and the dove. A map of the Khilafa and Alamut. I remember this perfume. I smelled it in the bazaar and perhaps in the harem. But on who? Yet, for its grandeur, the room is all but empty. Things look to be missing, including Kabiha herself. What happened? Ah, being poisoned! <gasps> what is this? What did you give her? She always drank from it. She asked me to give it to her. It's harmless. You call this harmless, Nasreen? You should go. Now, give me the key. What happened to her? You didn't give me the magic potion, did you? Me. You really shouldn't have left me alone with that flask. I'll search the rooms. You with uh, me. I did nothing. I did not hurt her. What did you do? Relax. No one is looking at us. They will be far too busy with the book they find in Nasreen's room. Nasreen's room? The garden and its mysteries. Nothing body, just a study of native herbs, their properties medicinal, poisonous, cosmetic. Oh, you set Belladonna, her up! Deadly nightshade. It does make the eyes look lovely in small doses. Same, I had to waste it all on her. What? 
You saw them. Farah and Nasreen, dripping poison in everyone's ear, spreading lies and rumors about my mistress. Kabiha. One dead, the other disgraced. No one will hear them now. Yes, Siala. What are you? Loyal. In Kabiha's absence, I defend her throne from those who would supplant her. Her office is empty. She has abandoned you, Makira. You serve a faithless mistress. She will return from the palace when the danger has passed. You really should not have told me that. It makes no difference. You will never find her. Now, play nice. There are children present. Nice uniform, by the way. Suits you. I can do nothing for Farah. But if Kabiha is the head of the Order, I could still spare those who have yet to suffer at her hands. Wait, is it one of those parts where, um... I want this. Isn't one of those uh, uh, like parts where we get like three suspects and we gotta choose like if uh, it's the right one or not? Now before we go any further, let's change back. Now for the third one, Arib. I need your eyes, my friend. What beautiful homes. Far different from the slums of Anbar. Thanks again, Enkido. Let us hope she is home. You will not bar me from my guests. This is my house. Bought with my generosity. Bought by my genius. For tokens, favors, and personal dedications, you may find Sayyida Arib in the garden after her recital. Good day. You must be her patron. It is an honor, Sayyidi. If I may, I seek a private audience with the poetess. Do you? I have been moved beyond words by her... words. Symmetry of sky and sea. I only wish to express my sincere admiration. Pretty words. Nearly as pretty as hers, and just as false. We both know what mask she wears, don't we? Mask, Sayyidi. Enough, Sayyidi. I know what you are, and I know why you've come. You think I haven't seen you skulking in the shadows. She's no longer party to your plots, your secret meetings, your foolish nicknames. I have scrubbed her clean of them. For I have set a watch on her door. My men dog her recitals. Every letter she's had of you I have shredded or sent back. Sent back? You will find them piled at the postal bureau. Burn them. Bury them. Do what you will. You can choke on them for all I care. He thinks we're with the order? Foolish nicknames, secret meetings. The patron may have thought me a member of the Order of the Ancients. Yeah, that's what I thought. The piles of letters at the Postal Bureau may reveal more. Let us see what mask you wear, poetess. Before I do that, let's upgrade another skill. Five points. Let's finish off this branch. The 
postal bureau. You may not enter at this I will do as the Boyun do. Sift through strangers' mail and sniff out conspiracies. Everybody's last words. What? Okay, I see the letters. of sin or I will do it for you. How kind. Moving on. Dearest Arib. Dearest Arib, your poetry has touched me deeply. You are my oasis, lush and yearl of Korof. Stranger, after honey drips from her lips. After the honey drips from her lips. Athaleb leaves the garden and follows the mouse. Secret order correspondence? Bad poetry? A bit of both? Harib could be Athaleb. The patron spoke of a recital in the gardens. I could give this letter to Harib and see where the vixen leads me. Abu Abdullah is the true Khalifa and will soon reclaim his stolen throne. I will leave this one for the Uyun. Oh, there's another one. Man! Please note that your payment of 15 dinars is overdue and must be. Nope. Oh, I guess some of them are just like letters you can interact with, but they have nothing to do with the quest. I will go to the garden, give Athalab her letter, and follow where she goes. Scorch as the desert, I will bathe in your feet. Strike as the cobra, but plunge me, you ocean. Desert, cobra, dove, all shapes and humors will I embrace. Hello there. Have we met? Come, don't be shy. I rarely bite and I never leave a mark. <laughs> It seems there's no privacy in the public eye. How came you by that letter? Who put you up to this? I work in the dark to serve the light. <laughs> I've met the men who serve the light. It seems its glare oft leaves them blind. 
are your masters so blinkered and bumbling? You were warned, you son of a dog. Come a reap. We will set no tongues to wagging here. Yours is the tongue that will not still itself, even when I beg for silence. You spurned the counsel of he who raised you, and without whom you would still be nothing? I raised myself. I authored myself. I have written myself into history. You are banished from my pages. Now be gone! How can I leave you to walls such as these? You're a woman alone, unarmed. Words are weapons enough for me. Then let us see what defense they offer. Take her. There is somewhere the Sayida needs to be, and you are delaying her. It seems that words can summon shields. We will need to make this quick. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Arib has left for her secret meeting. I must hurry. The letter commanded Athalam to leave the garden and follow the mouse. Perhaps Arib is not lost to me yet. How far will the fox flee? Oh, I see. Yet another painted mouse. Wait, I know it's right here. The nail! Another crumb to follow. I am growing tired of this chase. Better keep a low profile. Okay, so it's right there. Or else? Oh! Looks like it's telling me jump. Oh, so that means higher ground. One eternity later. Oh man, that took a minute. I thought that, that was meant to jump so I had to go to the second floor, but instead it's back here where it's hidden. Oh my god. Follow the maps. Really? You should bring him before the Medallion Court. But he thinks only of my reputation, Sarah. To safeguard success, I must be palatable, discreet. He fears I am too proud. <laughs> you? Never. I write that love is feral and free, unbound by stricter or statute. Should I not practice what I publish? Practice makes perfect. It also makes enemies. So be it. But let me choose them. Courtiers, caliphs, patrons, partners, so many men have tried to decide my enemies. <laughs> and friends. Though Allah knows I once chose poorly, he hid himself well. And a poet needs patrons, even one so great as al -Talab. Well, I have my pick. Good. There's trouble times ahead. I will be fine. I have survived six caliphs. I will survive... Six more. Don't worry, Sarah. I'll kiss the rings I need to kiss, but I will not be bound again. Not by anyone. Secret meetings. 
coded names. There is no trace of the Order here. Still, she has her pick of patrons. Maybe the head of the Order is not Harib herself, but an admirer. I have seen enough from my three suspects. Time to seek Roshan's counsel and end this once and for all. All right, so here's my theory. So right now we are talking to three people, uh, like three suspects, the governor, a poet and a concubine. Or I believe the second one, uh, the second woman uh, we tried to find was a concubine, like a mistress or something. But anyways, so I wonder if it's one of those because in Assassin's Creed Odyssey, it had a lot of that. Like you can actually give a wrong answer and it has a wrong al a different outcome. So my question is, is it like that? Like we have to choose one of the three suspects, like uh, who is the head of uh, the order or it's just gonna, uh, or we're just gonna report back and say I did what has to be done now. Uh, these three, this is what I learned from these three. Let's see what happens. Basim, you appear decided, Basim. What have you learned? Arib is innocent. The governor less so. He made a deal with the order and removed his cousin's protection from Alamut. Happen. Just as we had feared. We've been bare to our enemies. Yes in exchange for Abu Abdullah's renouncing his claim to the throne. He seized his crown to suit the order, led by- His mother. Gabiha is the head of the snake. Where is she now? Fled to the palace. If we act now, we can spare Alamut. Give me the feather, master. Gabiha will meet swift justice, and I will be the one to deliver it. What? What are you saying? That a more seasoned hand is needed. The last time you entered a palace, you left it in disarray, to put it lightly. Have I not proven myself since? Master, I have earned the right. Earned what? The right to kill? No, no, that is not. A blow from one of us is a blow for all of us. Or does your ego demand the honor? It is not ego, master. It is duty. I took an oath to leave my life behind, to walk the shadows and to serve the light. I mean to. Abiha is more dangerous than her underlings. Strike quickly and end this. Do not hesitate. Blood from a stone. Who is she to keep you from Kabiha, or to tell you when to strike? My master and mentor, without whom I would be nothing but a corpse in the streets of Anbar. You spy on me now? Always. So you will swallow your questions, strike at her enemies, serve without complaint. And live your life dogged by El Jinni in the hovel you once hoped to escape. You know where to find me when your duty is done. Many dead or disappeared. And each trail of blood leads back to you, Al Bahamut, the last mask to be lifted. You set Wasif on the rebels, unleashed Al Ghul, sold your son's crown to seize Alamut. And all for what? Some worthless token of a long forgotten age. No matter. I will see you at the palace. I will cut the head from the snake. Assassinate uh, Kabiha, head of the Order of the Ancients Kabiha. I'm sorry if I said that incorrectly. Has fled her rooms at the harem and hidden herself within the uh, Khalifa uh, Palace. The grounds are likely to be well guarded given how the last Caliph met his end. Yet there may be a select few on the premises that Kabiha would trust with her secrets. 
All right, so there's talk to mercenaries or however you want to say bribe, steal a key. I don't know what this is. Uh, stealth and unique kill. So far, I have unique killed every single order member. Let's see if I can continue that streak. Serving the light. All right, Nkidu, what do you see? Alright, so there's two opportunities right now. I'm a master now? Oh! And I got the master assassin costume. Nice! It seems Ali decided to attack the palace after all. His rebels could distract these guards. You, hidden one! You think you can help us pass these gates? They're barred from the inside. You appeared primed for a fight, brothers. I will see what I can do. All right, so I can open the gate and let the rebels in. So this could give me a uh, like a way to uh, cause like distraction, I guess you could say. But how do I get in? Man, the walls are all spiked. Oh, something flew in my eye. Sorry, guys. I There's another opportunity over there, but... Abiha will be on her guard. Oh, I gotta open the door for them? Come on! What? Alright, I'm out of knives. Nice. So they'll be distracted at the front. What is nice at least? Oh, nice. Oh, there's a musician. It would brighten the day and draw the guards. Wonderful playing. Ahlan Zaidi. I'm afraid you are early. I am still warming up. I think you are warmed up enough to play for those guards. Perhaps. But not for free. 
Don, here you are. Thank you for supporting the art. Let us hope this clears the gate. We still need to clear that right there. So I guess this guy doesn't like music. Servants go where they will. This man might help me open such heaviness in the air today. These are treacherous times. And most inhospitable. Are we not bade to honor the guest as he is entitled? We are. But Al Mutawakkil was murdered in his winter palace. Security has increased here since. I can see that. Everywhere I go, I am met with dark looks and locked doors. If only this were enough to open them. If only. <laughs> well, it's a good thing I have enough. An open door is a priceless thing. I didn't want to take the chance of saying you're too greedy, then he might like turn me down, but I mean, I have enough tokens, so I'm not complaining. Damn, how many locked doors does, uh, does this place have? This will throw open all doors. I hope your visit improves. I feel a change in the air already. Now I will move with ease. Famous last words. We need more men! Ali's rebels are at the gate. Isn't the door open? Yeah, there we go. God. You'll be back. I'll be waiting. Attention seeker. You hiding Let's try this.
Where is your mother? Do you have any idea who I am? Where is Kabiha? I do not know. I haven't seen her since she made me sign away my birthright. Then where would she hide? Think! There is a passage in the library. I followed her once. She used one of the books. Ah! Is that where she's kept safe while I've faced imprisonment and humiliation? Threats of death and... I know you. You were there that night, with that object clutched in your hand, and my father dead at your feet. That light, those voices. I thought I'd gone mad. Everyone did. Everyone except my mother. She... Will you kill her too? Will you not stop until all of us are dead? First the scholar, now Kabiha. These Order members love to hide among the books. Okay, it's time to get to the second floor. There must be a room beyond this one. But how to reach it? What was it Arib recited? Rage as the ocean, I'll sweeten your storms. Scorch as the desert, I'll bathe in your heat. Strike as the cobra, but plunge in my breast. Many volumes by Arib. Kobiha is an admirer. Blue, black, white, and yellow tomes. Kabiha chose to mark her path. She had Arib's book in her office. Wait. Scorch as the strike as the cobra, but plunge in my breast. Soar as the dove, but a light in my nest. Uh, let's try something else. Wait, I just want to make sure I'm getting this correctly. So, let me try the uh, poem again. I'm sorry I skipped it. What was it Arib recited? Rage as the ocean, I'll sweeten your storms. Blue. Scorch as the desert, I'll bathe in your heat. Strike as the cobra, but plunge in my breast. Yellow. Soar as the dove, but a light in my nest. White. Okay, so I say it's blue, black, yellow, and white. Because it says with the ocean, so ocean's blue. That's why I'm guessing, so let me try this. Perhaps there is a clue in one of her poems. Symmetry of sky, or ocean desert cobra dove. Ocean desert cobra dove. the desert the black or the yellow one I know the dove is the white one so it's the two in the middle that keeps on getting me
I must have missed something. Okay, so let me switch the other uh, two. Let's put the black one here. Yellow. The ocean is blue, the desert gold. So the yellow one is the second one. One eternity later. Holy hell! Someone took great effort to hide this place. Alright, before we go any further, I'm gonna show you guys. So the correct order was blue, yellow, black, white. So I had the correct order. I just put them in the wrong... Uh, I just put them in the wrong place. Uh, I started over here. But the thing is, you're supposed to start over there. So blue, black, yellow, I mean, I mean, blue, yellow, black, and white books. And once that happens, this door opens. So I had it, but I just put, put them in reverse. Oh my god. Get back here. Ooh, I almost got you. I almost got you. So many years spent searching, combing ancient tomes and tombs, tracing forgotten histories, snatching at rumor and at myth. When all I needed to do was wait for you. To come to me. <laughs> Our prodigal scion has arrived. Yet he knows not what he is. <laughs> Have you not wondered at your nature? You. Who see more, who know more. Even my son knew to ask what you were. When he saw your hand touch and wake the ancient's gift. What am I? Something more than man. Enough riddles. Speak plainly. Why speak what can be shown? Come with me to Alam. Beneath its temple walls lies all the knowledge that you are heir to. Your so-called brothers would sooner die than see you claim it. But take heart, Basim. We will prepare the way. And set you free. Ah, no! Yeah, I thought so. What poison have you lapped at her lips? She said I was something more than man. What did she mean, Roshan? What lies beneath the temple? That is forbidden ground. There's nothing there for you. I told you of the nightmares. The jinni. You called it weakness. Told me to mend it. I tried and tried, but you hid the way. 
You let me struggle alone! Not alone! You are not the first to walk the shadows broken, Basim. Stitch your shattered pieces into a hole. Pour your pain into the Brotherhood. Hurt yourself of the poison she dripped and come home to us. No more than a man, but no less than our brother. Or is it too little for you? What if it is? Follow the path she laid out for you, and I will kill you myself. Oh. an exit up there but I don't know if I can climb that Nihara to hide out. 2500 meters? Okay, so we managed to evade and escape. So now we are going back the to see we have. has for art these days. Basim really doesn't like how they uh, drew him on those posters. Citizens, in light of recent allegations, the shorts are hard on my heels. Last time I, I could was use some there. respite. Anwar's dog is Barely keep my eyes open. Okay, here we are. Basim, are you well? Basim. I. I do not know. You. You were right, Niha. My enemy, Kabiha. She held the answers. What did you learn? That there is more to who I am. A truth Qabiha tried to tell me. A truth my master sought to silence. That truth lies at Alamut. So we ride for Alamut. So we're going against the assassins now? Are you certain that you wish to leave Baghdad? You will need to complete Basim's journey at Alamut before returning to Baghdad. Alright. I will go, Nihal. I alone. You need me. 
I need you safe. I am safe with you, and you with me. I may find nothing there but danger and death. This is my fate. I will not turn back from it, but neither will I have you face it. Where you go, there I will go. Where you rest, there I will rest. I will walk behind you every step of the way. You are never alone. Now get packing. We will not leave Alamut until you have found the answers you seek. These are cool shots. They were not prepared. <laughs> They didn't have enough water and all that. you were expecting, eh? Well, at least you had the fortune to be elsewhere when the Tahirids came for us. What happened? I, uh... Fear Alamut has fallen. I was tasked with finding help. I went into the desert to find other patrols. Then I found you. Were there others with me? No. Only you. Then Nia lives. And Roshan? I had hoped she would be with you. Come, brother. We must head out. Find any survivors and cleanse Alamut of its infestation. I, uh... fear I cannot. How bad? I will make every last one of them pay. Vengeance is not our way, brother. Our way? You sit bleeding to death and still cling to this foolish dogma. And for what? Our creed could not protect Alamut. And neither could I. Nor I. But our beliefs are why you still draw breath. And are why you must save any of us who may yet live. On that we can agree. You have my word. Oh, fuck of Allah, Basim. There is nothing left to say, brother. Go! Save who you can. Steady. Steady, girl. All is well. All is well. Sounds like Basim is about to leave the order. I care. Our temple. Whatever lies beneath, I must see it for myself, no matter the cost. All this blood and death 
Is this what Kabiha meant by preparing the way? Nihal, please be safe, wherever you are. Oh, never mind. I thought that uh, we could uh, like approach it from above. I hate seeing dead assassins. Except for in Rogue. Some of my clan still live. Mentor Rehan among them. Oh, there we go. Ammo crate. I thought you were in Baghdad. Where are the others? Roshan? I came alone, for the same reason these men did. I know the truth, Mentor, about the temple and what it shelters. Our enemies told me as much. They urged me to seek it, because only I could. You? Thus the Order used the Tahrids to decimate Alamut, because you... You are their key. To what? What are you protecting that is worth all this bloodshed? Ancient ground. For generations, it has been our duty to watch over it. Defend it from the Order, who seek to exploit its secrets. The temple houses its entrance, but Basim, even though it is forbidden, I have searched. There is no means to access it. Then I will find a way myself. You must not. It is what the Order wants, don't you see? If what we protect should fall into the wrong hands... It will fall into mine. Look around you, at what the Order is prepared to unleash upon us. If I can gain the knowledge they seek, it can be what finally gives us an edge in this endless war. This is the way forward. For the Hidden Ones. Well, at least the mentor agrees, thank god. Oh, I only have one throwing knife. Not anymore!
Shukran, awesome. So, are there like assassins we can like save? Or is it just like something we could do along the way? The temple. Let us finish this. Nothing and no one shall get in my way. Not now, not when I am this close. It will take more than you to stop me. More of them ahead. Suffice to say, I am on the right path. Oh, is the one on the disc? Oh. <clears throat> Damn. I warned you what would happen. Last chance. Oh my. Very well. So it has come to this. Killing each other. Is this your idea of a brotherhood? The brotherhood is unified. There is no place for those who would set themselves smoke. Is that what you think I am doing? Wake up, Basim. Walk the order's path. The very people you saw fight against. You're fulfilling their mission. Endangering the very thing you saw to defend. Free will. This is mine. How what? can I champion something denied to me? Your creed is flawed. How do I... Do I have to throw it back at her? What's her weak point? Oh, her weak point is her shoulder. What? Take out the shoulder. There we go, God. Last chance. I want her sword. Oh, 
Oh, damn, damn, damn. I trusted you! I gave you everything I had, and you lied to me! You knew me. Since the night we fled unborn, you knew my team. I only feared what it could do. But I said... What you may find in there. You do not have to look to the past to know who you are. Who you can be. You can choose, Basim. Put your faith in me. I tried. And in the end, you thought it best to control me. No different than our enemies. Basim, over here. I know what this is. The key. She will follow. No. She cannot. You saw it yourself. Whoa. Are those all like those Masyaf key discs? Whatever lies within carries grave importance. For the Hidden Ones. For the Order of the Ancients. For me, what have we walked into? Where has my path brought us? You do not want to know why anyone was brought to this place. Are my eyes deceiving me? Are you seeing this? That's cool. Mihan? Yeah? I am. I am here. Wherever we are, it was okay. built long ago. To serve what purpose, I do not know. I do. How? I... I do not know. Nihal, you are worrying me. Nihal, look in here. Is she like an ancient one? Me. 
もっと These visions, they are one and the same. So is the genie the like him? I have been seeing the memories of a life long ago. Are they mine? Is that why the genie feels so real? My tormentor, the source of all that ails me. If this is so, then I must face you. All the kids hang. From one part to the other, but it shows it massive order, now, order. Or why it haunted me so. But I am beginning to remember. You can't do anything. I am in a cold cell, begging for it all to stop. Who I once was may seek retribution. But if I am to move beyond this pain, then what I want is peace. It is time to put an end to this. The 
need it. Leap of faith. It's only the beginning, for us, for what lies ahead. A deeper understanding of the world we left behind, and our place in it. All my life I wrestled with who I was. Who I was meant to be. And there you were, all this time. Side of me I resisted. A reflection of who we once were. Of who we shall be once more. There is so much that awaits us. A new world. Let me show you. I will never see you again, will I? Will I be alone? You are never alone. It is done. You made your choice. Roshan. Now, I make mine. Is she leaving? Wadaan Roshan bin Ahad. It was an honor. Wish. You've been Come, Basin. We have much to discuss. <laughs> that we do, mentor. Is she a descendant of Altair or am I tripping?
Oh, that's beautiful. Why? This memory I buried of this place, this prison, the torture I suffered here, it festered for years. In darkness and dreams, masked as a jinni, to haunt me and hollow me until it consumed my waking life. But I have faced my past, my pain, embraced it. I shed my skin once, in another time, another place. But I am whole again. I remember. And as for those who thought to bind me, should any of them still walk the earth? I so look forward to our reunion. But until that day, a new world awaits. Wow. Yeah, the credits. Looks like we're back in Baghdad. Shukran, congratulations on completing Assassin's Creed Mirage. You've been returned to Baghdad with all your gear and equipment from before the final chapter of Basim's journey in Alamut. Alright, there you guys have it. We have completed Assassin's Creed Mirage. I really do wish the game was a lot longer so we could keep this going on, but... Oh well. But now we gotta wait for another Assassin's Creed game. <laughs> I mean, this game was a lot of fun. That ending took me by surprise, like fight, uh, fighting Roshan and also like Nihal was just all in mind. I mean, does Basim have like some sort of like mental disorder? I mean, like I remember in the movie, like um, uh, Beautiful Mind with uh, Russell Crowe. I only remember that movie because I had to watch it in sociology or psychology class back in high school and what it was is it was like this mathematical genius who had schizophrenia so any chance Bessim has schizophrenia or is he just like haunted with his past memories I don't know well anyways, anyways guys uh, this game was so much fun so now uh, we're just gonna like take it easy a little bit until the next game like Spider-Man 2 or UFC 5 or anything like that who knows we'll see what happens next but anyways, thank you guys for watching and thank you for sticking, sticking with me throughout this entire series for Assassin's Creed Mirage and also check out my other gameplays that have my channel like my reaction videos and my other gameplays and also keep an eye out for more content because uh, now, you know, today is Sunday so I got to start work and school again tomorrow so uh, who knows what my schedule will turn into. And also, again, thank you so much for your continued support. This channel is growing so keep it up and I hope you guys are having an amazing day and I'll see you guys next time.